Hundreds of babies die in their sleep in Texas every year, and officials say the numbers are growing. In 2011, a record 174 young children died due to co-sleeping. In the first 10 months of this fiscal year, there have already been 164. KXAN's Angie Bevan joins us now with why the numbers in Travis County are so alarming. Well, officials with Child Protective Services say in all of 2013, in our 30-county Central Texas region, there were 13 deaths due to unsafe sleeping conditions. Conditions. In Travis County so far this year, there have been 11 infant deaths. CPS says most of these deaths are preventable. Investigators say it happens suddenly, unexpectedly, and often without a clear explanation. Often it's when a parent falls asleep alongside a baby. The majority of the deaths in the past five years are babies younger than one year old. Over the next two months, the state is spending $100,000 on an online advertising and social media campaign to educate parents the safest place is alone in a crib. It's the ABCs of safe sleep, which is babies should sleep alone, on their backs, in a crib, in a smoke-free environment. And to add to that, the crib should have a fitted sheet on a mattress that's made for the crib with no blankets or extra bedding. And also, parents shouldn't let babies sleep with older siblings. Angie, what exactly is this public service campaign going to look like? What they're going to have, it's going to be an online advertising campaign, and they're going to be able to market through different marketing strategies to young and new parents. All right, Angie Beth, thank you so much for being here. We appreciate it. We're going to have a link uh, to this story on KXAN.com. You may remember last year, I did an investigation into infant death in Central Texas. In several cases, babies suffocated because of a blanket or a bumper pad on a crib. You can see that investigation and find more helpful resources again with this story at KXAN.com.